I have with me today the Managing Director of Briggs Communications, Alan Briggs. Thanks for your time today, Alan. Thanks, James. Alan, today we're going to have a look at what organisations should be doing in the lead up to Christmas. So, what has the BC team been up to in the lead up to uh, 2016 Christmas? Well, James, we've actually been very busy over the last few months preparing our clients ready for the Christmas break. Uh, Murphy's Law, things can go wrong when no one's around. So just making sure they're well prepared should something go wrong. And in your mind, what are the four things businesses and organisations should be preparing in the lead up to Christmas? Well James, there's four critical things. One is your contact list and that's contact of your staff, your key, key stakeholders, suppliers, tenants, um, your board members, investors, people that really need to be contacted in, in a time of an emergency. Next thing is actually identifying who will be on the crisis team, who will be available to come in should things go wrong, and not only just their mobile phone number, but their home number, and maybe a phone number of their next of kin, um, their spouse, so that somebody can be contacted and get them to come in if they're required. Next thing we need to think about is have you got a hard and soft copy of their crisis plan? So everyone should have a hard copy available to them and ideally a soft copy that they can use, put into their laptop, desktop and start operating if they're called upon. And lastly, the most important thing is that you are able to actually access these things um, either in the cloud or in another storage system so that you can access them and operate remotely. You don't actually have to come into the office. Now if I've left it too late and I'm about to clock off for the break and I don't have time to prepare those things that you just listed then, what should I do? What should I be doing? Well James, the best thing is to actually log on to our website at briggscommunications.com.au. We actually have a ready-made template that you can use and certainly give us a call and we can assist you to put a, a temporary um, measure in so it can cover you over the Christmas break. So if you're unprepared, it's certainly best to have uh, some sort of plan in place rather than winging it hoping nothing will go wrong. Thanks for your time today, Al. You're welcome and uh, hope everyone has a great Christmas break.